Today, we're going to be talking about the bystander effect in the realm of cyberbullying. What is cyberbullying, you ask? Cyberbullying is the same kind of bullying that we experience in our regular lives, but on the vast platform of the internet. In real life, there can be a group of bystanders that watch bullying without speaking up. But on the internet, the number of bystanders can be multiplied, sometimes even to the millions. So what can you do if you're a target of cyberbullying? First, never take it personally. Next, check your resources. Most social networking sites have a block or private option. Block out anyone you don't want to see your profile. This is a step above even ignoring someone in real life. Now what should you do if you think you see cyberbullying on the internet? If you're not comfortable confronting the bully, that's perfectly okay. There are other steps you can take, such as reporting or blocking the hateful comment, telling a school administrator or a trusted adult, trying to reroute the attention of the bully, or privately comforting the target of the harassment. Another good idea is to take notes on the comments that were made, or even take a screenshot of the discussion in case it's deleted in the future. And if you are comfortable standing up to the bully, that's fantastic. <sighs> Just make sure you use appropriate language and don't stoop to their level, as that could damage your own net reputation. For more information on how to stay smart when it comes to bullying, visit us at safeconnects.org.